Hello, welcome back to my channel. In this week's video, we're going to be talking about the Essence sale and what's going on. I now have a love-hate relationship with the Essence sale, but I'm gonna tell you why. Some more sale tips um, in addition to my last year's video and a couple of pickups that I have and what is on my wish list for this season sale. I was at the Hermes store and I got my Balenciagas. I'm not sure if I said this in the last video, but I think I've said it on my channel before shop the men's section whether you're a dude or a girl or whatever it's cheaper and sometimes there's more stock availability sometimes it will literally be the exact same item that they also sell in women's and yet it'll still be cheaper uh jacquemus pink fluffy headband last season it was also sold in the men's section and it was selling for like ten dollars cheaper ten or twenty dollars cheaper and i was like what I looked, it was the exact same headband. There was no specific dimensions that were different or anything. And I was like, you guys are scamming us. Ladies, check the men's section. You never know. And like, men's clothing is really sick too, so. And then also I think one time I remember seeing something was sold out in women's, but it was in stock in men's as well too. So not even just for a cheaper cost in sale, but for stock availability, so. Check men's or the other gender as another option. Okay, so obviously Essence has their seasonal sales. Yes, spring, summer, and then fall, winter. But you've probably noticed they do 15% off now pretty regularly before the actual seasonal sales start. So they usually do it about two to three times before. Keep that in mind if there's something that you need before sale season. Pick it up with 15% off because you really never know. You don't know how deep the sale is going to go once it actually hits sale time. I say this because my other tip is sometimes they take away the sale price and they put it back to regular price a week into the sale. Yeah. They change their mind. They just do a lot of rejigging. I'm just going to call this tip rejigging with the sale. There was something in my wish list and I it went on sale and I was like, oh my gosh, I think I should buy it. A week later it got taken out of the sale and it's still not on sale to this day. I feel like they monitor what's in our wish list and our shopping carts and adjust accordingly. So wild to me. Or maybe what's selling out, they're just like, oh, we don't need to give you a discount. I don't know, there's no rhyme or reason to it. Just be careful. If there's something you really, really want and it never goes on sale and it finally does, just buy it. Just buy it, babe. And I don't think things are final sale unless they're like 70% off, so. Another thing as well too with rejigging the sale is there was a couple of pieces that I want, which I'll talk about in a moment, that were available for 15% off. I didn't buy it because I was like, you know what, maybe they'll go on sale later during the seasonal sale. Did they go on sale? Are they on sale in the seasonal sale? No, they're not. No, they're not. So this is what I t I'm talking about my love-hate relationship with Essence right now because I'm like, y'all are so wishy-washy with what you want to put on sale that I'm like, babes, why? Sorry, I'm getting really passionate about this because <laughs> me and my sister are always talking about what's in our wish list and it's just like, it's getting to me. Some of these pieces that didn't hit the sale during private sale or during public sale just randomly recently went on sale. And I was like, I was waiting for you to go on sale, but literally you took a month to go into promotion. And I'm like, babe, it's too late now. I already took my butt to Holt Renfrew and bought on sale there. But Renfrew goes on sale for like 50% off on the first day of their sale. So I'm like, sorry, Essence. My money went elsewhere. We're gonna talk about a couple of pickups. I think everybody knew about this brand before me and I'm just like, it's okay, I'm lost to the party, it's fine. The Dime brand, um, I think they're based in Montreal. Um, one of my friends, Tian Hey, if you're watching girl, she went to the actual store in Montreal when she visited recently. And then when she came back, I was like, girl, I need to buy something. She's like, they're on Essence. So Dime is a pretty affordable brand. I picked up this corduroy bucket hat from them. I thought this would be really sick with like oversized loose denim. I also picked up this oversized white t-shirt with the blue writing. I thought this would be a cute fit together and I bought this in a medium I think because I wanted it to be properly oversized but yeah this would be so cute together I think both pieces are like $50 each I think I bought these when they had a little 15% off going on so again utilize that 15% off because it's a really good option what is that oh my gosh Crocs their vibe whether you like it or not for the cottage running random errands 
guys like calm down I'm not gonna wear these to dinner or anything but like with socks a sweatsuit or whatever like to throw on their vibe I really like this nude neutral pair because um, it goes with everything the bathe color of course and this is just a good go-to I didn't get these on 15% off or on sale I'm not sure if they could ever go but essence has a bunch of colors of these now um, yeah, there's a really cute platform pair in black that I kind of want, which is in my wish list now. Yeah, I think that's all I bought from them recently. Like, I have so many other luxury um, hauls to show you guys on this channel um, upcoming, but I just, I didn't really buy much from Essence. But I'm still going to go over what is on my wish list because I still have... Okay, are we going to record the screen? We're going to record the screen. Hopefully this works! Socks are still on my mind. Like, there's still a vibe. And these Isabel Marant ones... They're cute. I like that green and pink combo. I've been really liking that green and pink combo in a lot of things recently. Those are two really big colors for the summer, so... Oh, these are on sale for 30% off. $70, though. Do I really want to? Ooh, pink. Okay, let me calm down. Let me calm down. 57 These are 57 But I don't need pink socks. Actually, I kind of do, because I bought this sweatsuit the other day. We'll see. Um, more Isabel Marant. I have this hat in the black and white. I wear it all the time. I really don't think need this black version with the pink, but I did see a hot pink one on Nordstrom that I'm like heavily considering, but we will see. Um, what else is in my wish list? Okay, um, yeah, these platform Crocs, they're kind of a vibe. They're kind of a vibe. Like, I might actually wear them in an actual outfit, but not, like, to dinner. Like, it's not like we're going to wear them to dinner. We're not wearing them on a date. Like, we're not doing all of that, okay? You're going to have to love me with or without my Crocs. These earrings by Sporty and Rich are really nice. I might check out with these right now, actually. These are cute. Like, these are a summer vibe with, like, hair in a bun and, like, highlight. Okay, add, add, add to cart, add to cart, okay. All right, what else is in my wish? Guys, okay, so Hourglass has never been on my radar like that, but I think I saw a couple of Balenciaga things go on sale or maybe a couple of Hourglass pieces, but I seen a girl with this color. Babes, this color is pretty. It is so pretty. I'm realizing I'm liking I like when Balenciaga does those really soft cute Chanel colors or pastel colors they're not really Chanel colors but yeah little flip flops things were in my wish list here I'm gonna keep it a buck I bought these already from Holt Renfrew yeah Essence you were sleeping like you were sleeping on me with the sale like these didn't even hit the sale I bought them from Holt Renfrew I really like this blue hoodie 26% off, but no, it's still $500. I'm not spending that. Is it? Does it have like a glitter logo? I think it might be glitter. Blue cotton hoodie. Crystal cut logo. I'm loving everything crystal from Alexander Wang. I don't want to talk too much about it here. I'm going to sip my lip, but if you follow me on socials, you know, you know. This Ami brand is on my radar. It's on my radar. It's a vibe. Um, but specifically I saw the pink one the pink set But I'm kind of over it now because I bought another pink sweatsuit. Ooh, what I really really want I want this Amiri hat But it's not touching the sale at Holtz or even on essence Like the trucker version It's cute. I think this is a hat. That's also in the men's section as well. I think at Holtz it's like 500 bucks This is why you gotta compare prices what do we think about this bag? You can be honest with me. I feel like the hype is getting to me, but that's all I'm gonna say. This is all I'm gonna say, babes. But if I were, this one right here. These pants, these pants make me mad. They make me so mad. So I wanted these pants, and I was this close to buying them when they were 15% off. Then they didn't go on sale the first couple weeks of the sale, and then now they're 18% off too late essence i spent money in other places also this dress 
this marine sayre dress i was really close to buying but it's still not on sale and it was available in the 15 percent off like when i put it in my cart like earlier on in the year i don't need it though and i have like a bunch of other orange handbags which i'm like ooh, maybe maybe ooh, the jacquemus one is on sale this one i kind of like the handle but the one that i was really really looking at from jacquemus Let's see if I'm going to handle. Ooh, this one. Oh, it's on sale, babes. I like this one. Le Bambino. Long bag. Like, look at that. Look at that on her shoulder. That looks like me. I don't like when Essence does this. <laughs> ah! Oh my gosh. That blue one's cute. Ooh, ooh, one last thing one, one last thing boxers are a vibe you wear them with your cargo pants opened you know high rise up or whatever it actually hit the sale i'm probably gonna buy these oh well, the tank top is kind of a vibe too oh i like how she styles it with the tank top okay, i kind of might need the tank top this this is sold out but it's still on my mind it's still on my mind this valentino one this was also a piece that was in the men's section as well too so that's why i'm always like cross-referenced but it sold out here it was just so expensive like 900 dollars for this necklace it reminds me of the vivian westwood one but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was helpful for you let me know what's on your wish list for essence or some pickups that you have had um or some other tips as well that you can share with us um yes make sure you watch these other videos you may have missed click my head to subscribe and follow me on these other socials so you can keep up to date i love you guys so much and take care